So, here's how it happens. I didn't understand that when you're the dad, you're the dad for life. So I had, I had told him, I said, I'll take you on some adventures sometime, buddy. And you know, I named a couple of adventures, and he didn't get back to me. And I thought, oh, he's busy, he doesn't want to go. You know, he's an adult, so if he really wanted to do it, I would handle it. Not so. He was waiting for me to be the dad and plan it and get it going. See? So I had to do that. So I planned this bicycle trip across Colorado Plateau with him. A couple of things you need to understand about that. One was that I had hoped it would be a life-changing adventure for him and a really wonderful time for both of us together. And I also saw it as an opportunity for him to get to know me better and me to get to know him better because he's kind of a quiet guy. He doesn't communicate much. So I had those two things in mind. The other thing is that in the five years previous to my decision to do this, I had had a heart attack, I had three stents put in my coronary arteries, I had a life-threatening internal bleeding incident, I had a hip replaced, right, and, and I had chronic uh, AFib. So, in the back of my mind, <laughs> you know, I'm thinking, you're going to die. <laughs> you're going to die by the side of the road and Wayne's going to be there and it's going to be so horrible. And that was one of my like, big fears.